The question I get asked most about diving solo in the West Kootenays is how do you get that suit zipped up by yourself? Well here's how I do it. Now everyone knows it's not impossible to zip up your own shoulder entry suit and dive solo. I've been zipping it up this way for years. You just have to make sure the zipper is lubricated properly so it zips without snagging. Diving solo isn't for everyone. Divers should be at a professional level and ensure all proper risk assessment steps are completed prior to the dive. Moving bottom debris under the bridge into different piles have kept me busy the last few dives. I am preparing a detailed video map of Nelson's Waterfront Park in preparation for a proposal to City Council about a dive park under Nelson's Bridge. Golden City Scuba will be having a treasure hunt for cash and prizes August 30th, 2009, where we will use these debris piles for navigational hints and landmarks during the treasure hunt. Email us if you are interested in diving in our treasure hunt. All proceeds will go to the Kootenay Foundy Regional Hospital Pediatrics Ward. Come out and find the treasure for the kids. During the years I have found a few backpacks and suitcases while diving. They are usually under one type of bridge or another. It's always exciting to find something like that as the scenarios of possibilities run through your mind as to how it came to be thrown off the bridge and what could be inside. Diving is like no other sport when it comes to exploration and discovery. Finding an old artifact from the 1800s or looking into a suitcase thrown in the drink yesterday is exhilarating and keeps you submerging time after time because you just never know what's down there. If you are interested in discovering scuba and adding diving to your list of year-round outdoor sports that will also give you a great vacation hobby, call us at Golden City Scuba in Roslyn, 250-362-7693 or visit us online at www.goldencityscuba.com. Register today for our treasure hunt August 30th, 2009.